guys, good morning. Working at a hospital on a Saturday, doing a little bit of OT. Changing out pulleys, belts. So, step into my office. Oh yeah. All right, have a seat everybody. Okay, what we're gonna do, we had to loosen our mounting bolts for our fan. Then we loosen our adjustments for our belts. After we do that, it'll loosen up. We take our belts off. We need an Allen key, it looks like, to loosen those screws. These actually are these separate screw holes. There's usually two or three of them here. What those are, those are for jacking purposes. You screw them in and it actually separates that inner bushing from your pulley, okay? And then you can easily slide it off. They're very nice to have. So, okay, wish we had some more light in here, but using my little Milwaukee lights, working out good right there. Yes, sir. All right, guys, wish me luck. Okay, well, I'm gonna give her a little shove. Da -na -na, da -na -na. Here we go. Okay. It's just how it's done, people. Just how it's done. Bam! Now, it looks like uh, possibly 7 16 or half inch on this one here. So I gotta reach around and get right in there, then get this one. Here we go. Hey guys, we already got these Allen screws loose, so I'm gonna use a drill. Pop it out. And I'm gonna put a little bit of lubricant right on these threads. Little bit. Okay. Take this one out. A little bit of lubricant right on these threads. I'm gonna put it in this other jacking hole. Now these are jacking bolts. They will push and separate this pulley. Okay. Okay, now we gotta use a socket. Socket wrench. Right here. <laughs> Now, just worked it free. Now to get this sleeve off of here, you spray a little bit of the PB Blaster down on the shaft here. If there's some rust, use a little bit of emery cloth. But what I tend to do, I just use that ridge. Now we just clean this shaft up, wipe it off, hit it with some emery cloth, and put the new bearings, the new pulleys right back on. Just that easy, people.
we already got our motor pulley on because that one was a real tough one to get. Now, set that on like so. Got this little key, all right? It'll fit in here, but you're gonna notice it's shaped funny. That's to slide in here. It locks it in place. So, set her like so, like so. And then, locks together. We got these three bolts. I leave them loose until I get it aligned where I want. And then I can go ahead and shift it back and forth. I can uh, basically see all that's nice and loose now. And that's because we sanded it properly. Just always make sure your key is in a good spot in between to hold the pulleys and that center bushing. Now we're just going to go for alignment. And then once we get it aligned, crank these down. It'll suck it together a little bit more because it's compression. It's like a wedge. And that's how it's holding it together. We'll put our new belts on check for alignment and make sure tension's good and fire it up, check amp draws. Okay guys, new pulleys are in. Bolts are tight, tight, looks good. Got a very good tension here because uh, these are B belts. Now, I generally, I try to get these things lined up. I don't know why, maybe it's an OCD thing, maybe, who knows, I just do that. And there we go, everybody. Smooth. 